welcomed at 877-572-8446. Stephen, welcome. Good morning. Good morning, brother. Uh, appreciate you being here. Um, get in nice and close on the mic. Let me yes, ask sir. you. Let me ask you this question. We've been playing the clips that you and I were watching in the uh, mm -hmm. room last night of Charlie, mm -hmm. and I've asked the question um, from the people that are watching that have dealt with addictions in their life. What do they see in his body language, in his use of certain phrases and words and the way he's describing himself in those clips that tell people that have struggled with addiction, what, what are some of the telltale signs that he's either clean as he claims or he's not clean as some people are also claiming? What's your take on that? Uh, it's a very interesting question, Kevin. And, and just like I, I picked Christian Bale to win the Oscar for Best Supporting yeah. Actor for the movie The Fighter because... You know, he plays this crack, crack cocaine addicted guy, but and, and he just so incredibly nailed the well, just the, I mean, the molecular little ticks and the nervousness and just little things. And and there's a whole lot of that I'm seeing with Charlie Sheen right now. Um, I, well, here's what I want to say. I, I mean, first of all, it's it's there's a whole lot of common sense logic in my mind. Look at how thin he is. Look at the sunkenness of his eyes. Like there's just a, there's just a lot for people of, that don't use. What does that mean? That means... Light weight loss means what? Sunken eyes means what? Well, usually, Rotted teeth means what? Usually, w with particular usage of, of particular drugs, you know, like crack cocaine, uh, like crystal meth, things like that, you know, he, he is demonstrating some of the physical results of, of, of that type of drug use. Now, here's the thing. I just want to say, this is just me now. I, I know this guy. I've seen this guy. I, I, I mean, he's not a friend. I don't hang out with him, but... but I might run into him, and I just want to say this. This is, this is a tragedy to me. This, this is, I mean, this, I get a lump in my throat every time I think about it. How we live in a society and a culture where somebody can achieve this type of stature and, and wealth and success and have this many fans. Where are the people picketing outside of, 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 of the network going, hey, you know, help Charlie, save Charlie, you hmm. know? We love him. We watch him on two and a half men every week. You know, you know. Uh, of course, if if some silly aspect of his rights had been violated, then people would be picketing. Not the fact that he's dying from drug addiction and, and this and that. That's just, an interesting observation. Yeah, it's just strange. Stephen Baldwin's with us. Uh, I, we got to take our break, but I sure. want to come back and ask you a couple of questions about the role that families can play and also what the money from Hollywood that's involved in this equation, what it means both to Charlie, to the studio, to the people that are involved, why that might be motivating some people to act or not act in this situation. Sure. But we're coming to you live from the National Religious Broadcasters Convention floor. Uh, and again, thanks to AFR for supplying us our, our internet feed this morning. We're grateful for them. And uh, Stephen and I, uh, you know, you see us on Saturday nights here on uh, Family Net Television. But uh, he got up early just to come down and, and talk about this with us this morning, and I'm grateful for it. We'll also take more of your calls at 877-572-8446, 877-572-8446. And let me say this. Thank you to Wholesale Direct Metals for making the Kevin McCullough Show available to you every single day. Do you have questions about your portfolio that you need answers to? Call them up, 800-226-8106. They've got a whole uh, packet that they'll send you for free. In 2010, I moved 50% of my long-term retirement from paper products to gold. 50%. They don't even ask you to do that. They say 15 to 20 will, will protect your portfolio. I did 50%. Find out why. You call today. Take care of your family's financial future. Coming right back on The Kevin McCullough Show.